So I had a video set to go live at 6 a.m. Central Time this morning, <clears throat> and I found myself having to re-record it because now it doesn't make sense. <laughs> so it was talking about why Cardano is down 4%, and clearly it's obviously not down 4% anymore. We got a huge spike just in the last you know hour or so here. And, I mean, the point still kind of pertains to it. So, you know, why are these moves happening, right? Why are these, like, wicks up and down happening? And it's really all it comes down to one thing, okay? It's it's actually really simple. So whales right now are, are changing their position in and out, up and down, right? And part of that is, you know, they're they're in the process of, of taking profits. I mean, we're seeing it right now. We're seeing some reaccumulation happening just kind of across the board. You know, they they obviously did a very good job of accumulating while the price was down and depressed. And now they are taking some profits right off the top. That's completely fine, right? And you guys may be doing the same thing as well, especially if you're, you know, following what the what, what the whales are doing. I there is a saying that pertains to this though obviously you know the the price looks like it's continuing to go down here we may continue you know falling further just as the the market continues to consolidate and i think it's important there's a there's a saying again it's called when in doubt zoom out and just taking a look at what is happening here this is this kind of gives you a good indication of what's to come we can see now ever since basically a week and a half ago we've been you know following this upward trend this bullish trend right and we get some random spikes in there, and then you basically have some profit taking, right? Accumulation right here, and profit taking. Accumulation, profit taking. You kind of get what I'm saying? So this this happens time and time again, and it's a smart thing to do, right? Because obviously we do get some of these these bull runs while we're in a bear market. Okay, I'm not saying this is the bull market cycle, but there can be bull runs inside of a bear market cycle, and that's what's happening right now. Obviously, the sentiment you know has gotten a lot better in the market um, you know over the last week and a half or so here, and a big part of that is you know due to the spike that we had. I mean, there was a lot of uh, a lot of short positions liquidated. Okay, I think it was uh, like 100, 120 some million or one hundred and sixty million dollars worth of shorts that that were liquidated that were forced to cover their position, which is not a small number by any means. <laughs> so. That's why the market pumped so fast the way it did. That's why we got that huge wick up the other day. This guy right here on the 25th, just zoop. So that's just what's going on right now. Obviously, I want to keep you guys updated on the things that are happening. And, you know, obviously, we're we're going to have a lot of chop like this. There's going to be a lot of ups and downs, um, but I think for the for the foreseeable future. I mean, we obviously have some big macroeconomic events that are happening. We know that. You know, we got these these reports coming out, the FOMC uh, meeting. We're going to find out about the interest rate hikes. Then we got the jobs report. Then we got the CPI data. All these things kind of, you know, fall right on top of each other this month. It's kind of a weird month for all that stuff. So, but we'll obviously pay attention, see what happens with Cardano. But, you know, again, just wanted to keep you updated on what's going on right now. Wouldn't be surprised to see another green day, actually, because everything seems like it's kind of going that direction right now. Well, there you go. Green day. Go figure. <laughs> but as always, I appreciate you guys stopping in, checking out the video. If you haven't already, do make sure you show your support for the channel. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that little bell. Again, that way you can stay updated anytime there's new content live here on the channel. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. I really hope to catch you in the next one. Take care, guys.